Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Fallout Tactics Redux. This is Colonel RPG as usual and I'm very happy that you're just joining me today as we storm these guys over here. I have made a conscious decision, I, I kind of knew that they were going to spot us. Uh, we can sneak with both Trevor and Earl, I think, and um, yeah, so the reason, that's the reason why I'm not sneaking with everybody. Uh, so yeah, this guy is going down, he's a beast lord, and up here... Oh yeah, I didn't show you this uh, last episode, but yeah. There's more Beast Lords and of course, a fully grown Deathclaw with 237 HP. He has Shred, which is uh, his ability is not really his weapon. His weapon has got the claws. The Deathclaws in this game are a little bit different from the Deathclaws in the first two games, just uh, appearance-wise, and also some other things. We're gonna find that, uh, we're gonna find out about that later, but for right now, uh, I'm gonna try and uh, kill this guy. Hopefully they're not gonna hear me, but if they are, that is okay. I'm gonna try and uh, make sure that I shoot him with uh, Jax, because that way I get the most out of my... Ooh, he's crippled now. That's fantastic. Okay, so this means that I will probably shoot first with Stitch, and he's got the kill. There oh, we got a we're out of sight of combat. It's fantastic. That is fantastic. That's way better than I than I was hoping it would be. To be honest, way better. So let me just uh, put everybody in place. This is one of those situations where I think uh, formation toggle button would be really good, really good to have. But unfortunately, there's no such thing. I need to go into the options menu or something. So yeah, whatever. Doesn't matter because because today, today I think. Oh, this guy. Let me save the game right there. I think he's gonna see us. Uh. And, ooh, he's got a hunting rifle, doesn't he? He does. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was, uh, was kind of considering shooting with Jax alone, but, um, Jax Malone? No. Oh, did I miss? No, I didn't. I didn't. 22 points. They're, they don't have armor, so it is kind of easy to kill them. Eh, Easy-ish. Let's see what Stitch can do. Second kill for Stitch! Stitch is on fire today! That's awesome! Uh, but yeah, as you can see, it's not really that easy to uh, keep a close eye on all these guys. There's only two of them patrolling. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into sneak mode here with Jax. This guy's gonna be here. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna. Be, they're gonna be here, ready to shoot anybody that approaches. I'm gonna try to get the loot out of these two, and from there, oh, that's some nice ammo right there that I do need. So yeah, let's take care of that. Ghoul quarter population twelve. <laughs> I'm not really sure if it is 12, I never really counted it, or if I did, I forgot. Uh, but yeah, anyway, uh, did we leave our Hummer so back here? Yeah, I'm probably gonna need to go back there and drop some of my loot, then I'm probably gonna do that off camera. Um, and we should be okay for looting. Uh, now, taking care of these guys is very tricky. The ideal way for me, anyway, it's usually to go into the buildings first. And then worry about them up here, sec, uh, up over there, second. But that's not necessarily the best way. I think it is good, but it's not necessarily the best way. Let me check up here and see if there's anybody on the roof. And it doesn't seem to be the case. There is certainly muties written over there. Um, okay, so at this point, I think I would. I'm I'm in a good position to do this. Switch to this mode, save the game. Uh, you switch out of... Oh, you, you guys? Oh, yeah, because he's up there. So, you guys go over there. I don't think they're going to see us. So, my idea, really, is to uh, have everybody be op up here. Let me also see if we can spot anybody that's down there, because they will be able to spot us. And I'd rather that didn't happen. Uh, so, yeah, I'm, we're going to enter through this level over here, over here, and I do want to see if there's anybody up here. I don't remember if there is. So, there's that. Uh, but apart from that, I think we're good for for this mission, for for this building over here. Uh, it's gonna be an interesting take. I, I'm not gonna be, uh, I'm not, it's just not, I'm not gonna be as ruthless as I've been so far. I'm gonna try and make this mission with as little deaths as possible, uh, because I think it is a very fun mission. I want to have fun with it, but I also want to, you know, do it justice. Do it as I as I would if I or uh, playing on tough guy mode for this mission alone. It is a very tricky mission, and each time I do it, I, I like to do it as as conservative as possible. That's also sneak right there. Uh, as conservative as possible, simply because when I do it, when I try to do it in tough guy mode, it is basically the big mission. The one that really, 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 I mean, yeah, at least in the early game, it's the one that really gets gets to me. 
Well, we're not really into the early game. I guess it's the sixth myth mission so far. There's nobody up here. We do have line of sight on those guys, uh, but there's nobody up here. That's good to know. Let's go down there again. Uh, actually, far side can take care of what I'm about to do. So she's sneaking. Uh, so she can crouch. You can crouch as well. I don't remember if there's anybody up, up here. Let's see. Check uh, just check the rooms inside. Everything seems good. I'm gonna go into uh, upright stance. Uh, and Jax is gonna go in, ready to shoot if he wants to, because that should be fine. And the key is at the ready. Yeah, we don't have anybody in here, that's good. Okay, so you guys crouch, you crouch as well, stop sneaking. Crouch, there we go. And go in there. You have not been detected, so that's good, that's good. I don't think there's gonna be anybody up here, but let me make sure that I don't screw things up. Also with these guys, there we go. And go over there. Just check. Just to check. There's dog. Oh, no, no, no. They what the hell? No crap. I think we're good. No, that guy. Yeah, he didn't see. I. If he. It's kind of crazy. Okay, so he's running the dogs. He's not walking the dogs. He's running the dogs. They are going to be a problem. Uh, but as long as we keep it in this building, we should be okay, and they're not going to be alerted. I'm not really sure that's going to go according to plan, so I am... Yeah, just, I, I'm not really sure. So let's see what we have down here. Down here we have what looks like a reception booth or something. There's uh, an American flag over there. Actually, that's... Again, it's the Fallout American flag. It has the different sort of stars going on, so yeah, I don't know if it's called the same thing. It's like the Confederate flag. It's not the Confederate flag. It's something else. Okay, so this is, this seems to be clear up here, which is fantastic. Uh, what's not fantastic is that, uh, no, 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 you come back here. Uh, what's not fantastic is that that wall right there, that door, is kind of open. And that's nasty because the guys outside are going to be able to spot us. But what I really want to do, what I really want to do from here, is I wanted to take out as many guys from this side as possible. I'm not sure if there are any here, uh, but I'm going to save and, and see if there is. If there are any. So you guys are kind of stuck right now. You go in like that. That guy, I'm not sure he's going to see you. I don't think so. But just in case he does. Yeah. I, oh, this is actually a very good approach. That thing is glowy. Why the hell is that glowy? Huh. Is that a bug? Oh, no. Oh, there's something in there. That's right. Uh, okay. So actually, this is safe to be here. That's good. Let's be careful with these guys. If there's only two of them, we should be totally fine. The death claw is going to be a problem, but it's not going to be the the biggest problem ever. Uh, but what I really want to do is I want to lure them. Oh, man. I don't can't get a line of sight from this one. You guys can go there. There's the one. Okay, so it is, it is, it is bad. What does he have? He's got a bone club. Oh, it's not that bad. It's definitely not that bad. Okay, so I'm going to have everybody stay out here. Stay back here. Uh, prone, even though we're facing melee characters, there's no real running from a death claw, so it's like, yeah, it's not like a red scorpion or anything. So they're gonna be prone over there. They're seeing them. They, yeah, they don't have line. They do have line of sight, but they don't mind us. So yeah. So let's have everybody be here. I am. Oh, you're stuck over there. Why are you stuck over there, far side? You need. You are an integral, integral part to my uh, wall operation. So you guys go ahead and do that. You're gonna sneak if you can, and I am gonna get up and shoot the. Oh, now he's got gore. He apparently, he didn't want sh sh shred anymore. He's got gore now. Okay, so what I'm going to do... Of course, I'm going to save. What I'm going to do is I'm going to... Ooh, take a shot there. Did I miss? I did, didn't I? Okay. That's not good. Next up, we're going to have... Um, we're going to have you guys be on Overwatch. I think that's going to be the better play here. And Jax is going to... Jax can... Yeah, Jax can run. I'm going to try and take another shot... At the Deathclaw. And I missed again. Come on, luck. Come on, RNG. You, you got... Oh, RNG doesn't have my back today. I'm not sure they're going to get in range for them. Uh, the reason why I didn't go with 66 Overwatch is that... Uh, yeah, they didn't get in range. Uh, that's not... Actually, I think we should be okay to shoot the Death Claw. Oh, actually, it, we are, we are going to be okay to shoot them both with a shotgun. Let's see what happens, though. Uh, hopefully, yeah, they don't get to turn. So let's go ahead and do that. See what happens. That's way better now. That is way better now. They are... This guy is going down. Without the armor, they are powerless to resist me. I am so charming right now. There's no way for them to do anything right now. So let's let's see what happens now. Oh, oh, there we go. That's what you get. He's almost dead, and he should be fine. 
I don't want to three. Okay, so Stitch and Staffy didn't get the Overwatches out. That's kind of understandable, considering they are the, uh, you know, the crappiest of our shooters. I am gonna try to take out the Death Claw. I think that's gonna be fine. Oh, I took out that guy instead. That's fine. Now, Farsight is gonna have the... Actually, it's gonna be Stitch. Ouch. That, that ought to hurt. That ought to hurt. So, we're outside of combat. We did well on that one. I'm satisfied. Let's loot the Beast Lord. See what he has. Some junk. Let's loot the Death Claw as well, just in case he has, like, a Death Claw Claw or something. Or is it just the Death Claw? I don't really know. Uh, but we're seeing already some ghouls. These are ghouls over here, over here, and this is, of course, Ghoul Town. We're not gonna take care of it right now because I do want to clear out that building, but I want to check out... Oh, that's... Oh, oh, this is Ghoul Town. The hell? Hey, man, what's up? Are you a friend of us, ghouls? I don't know. Mommy always told me not to mingle with strangers. Maybe if Elliot said you're okay, then we'd be pals. Yeah, maybe. Let's all have a chat with Elliot. Is it there where he lives? Who the hell is this guy? I don't remember seeing this. Oh, he's got a merchant here? We've got a merchant. What? I don't know what's going on, guys. This is new. It's new to me. Howdy, Smoothkin. Sm oh, it looks like... Oh, I was gonna say it looks like Harold, but they kinda all look like Harold a little bit. No, he's not Harold. It's Archibald Crump, the goal caravan leader in these parts. Let me tell ya, these beast lords are bad for business. I haven't been able to get a caravan out all m month, all month, and my supplies are dwindling. I do have a few good to a few goods to barter if you wanna. Yeah, I do. Maybe. Uh, let's see what you have. Uh, well, oh, the no, I don't need those. What the hell is that? Can you tell me what that is? Oh, that poor man's guide to brain surgery. <laughs> That's for a doctor. I don't need that, but that, that'd be interesting. Um, we got some H, HN needler cartridges, which are very rare, at least in the early game. I could buy them. I never used a weapon, though. And I think I don't think we have the weapon at all, so it's not really a problem. The piloting thing, it's totally pointless. I don't need that. I mean, it does improve your handling of the vehicles, but it's... I don't need them. That's... it's... it's pointless. Uh, and everything else is kind of meh at this point. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna buy anything from this fair... What's his name? Archibald... something? Anyway. Uh, let's... let's just look around a little bit more, because I think they... the... the, the Redux pass, patch... changed this area or something. Uh, it used to be... Yeah, over there, it used to be something, I think. But I'm just giving it a cursory... cursory look up here. Making sure that I don't miss anything, that's too obvious, but of course, nothing is really that obvious. So it's either I know where it is, or I'm gonna be very, very lucky. Mm -hmm. Okay, you got a couple of graves over here, there's nothing really that I think can be interacted with, otherwise I'd, have, uh, all that, all, I'd already have seen it uh, with, my, uh, yeah, with my cursor, because you don't need to see it to be able to change the cursor. Let's see what we have here. Nothing. Maybe somebody up here. Let's just give it a shot. But speaking of shots, I think we are... Oh, actually, uh, yeah, I need to level people up. Uh, I'm gonna bring her sneak up, because her, uh, her small guns are good for right now. Your stitch, you can... I don't know, guy. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go... Yeah, you need that. You very much need that. That's gonna waste my skill points in no time, but... Ah, well. Uh, yeah. It doesn't matter. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, Trevor is not gonna be around for too long, but if I bring this up, it's gonna be a good a good thing. And your sneak, you you would need that though. You definitely would. But anyway, let's see what we have here for Earl. Bring that up a little bit. Bring that up a little bit as well. There you go. And for Staffy, she hasn't leveled up yet. So let's see where Jacks. Oh yeah, I would were in the uh, character screen that pauses the game. Mm-hmm. Uh, so we, yeah, apparently this school is scared. There's ghouls all over, but as I said before, we're not gonna talk to them. We're just gonna... let's reload all our guns, by the way. Uh, we're just gonna continue clearing out these buildings, because I am not sure we're done. So, let's bring everybody out here, just as a, as a precaution. Everybody goes into this mode right there for 95%, please. Thank you very much. Now, Jax is gonna go in and clear out the... Jax, you're stuck? He's not. Yeah, there we go. So we're gonna go in and hopefully not meet anybody. Okay, so we got line of sight on that guy. This is a good opportunity actually to take try to take him out. Oh, there's no there's no passage here. Okay, that means we need to go there. And you can exit sneak and just go in and uh, enter sneaking again here. Just wanna see, just wanna be able to see if there's anything here. I wanna go upstairs. What were we upstairs? What the hell was this? Yeah, we came up down from there. 
Oh, that's right. We have we have a thing here. Forgot about that. Never mind me. So, yeah, I don't think there's going to be anybody in these buildings. But just in case, as I said, I'm trying to do this as cautiously as possible because it is more fun that way. Uh, and even though I know the map, it's a big map. It's a big map. It's a lot of missions as well. And it's been a couple of years since... Actually, it, it hasn't been a couple of years since I played the game. Since I started to play the game anyway. Uh, it has been like uh, probably a year and something. So almost almost a year and a half, maybe. I still have the... Um, the game installed, of course, in my my. Fly I, I usually have this game installed, not not too far into my my um, system reinstalls or anything. So what I want to do now, we're gonna have to go on a. Um, it's gonna be a little bit of a an adventure here, because we're gonna have a tough time dealing with that particular alarm system right there. They don't see me, so that's good. But the problem is, I don't want that to be triggered. There's another one over there as well. So oh yeah, I know what I'm gonna do. I know exactly what I'm gonna do. So these guys, we're gonna go through back here. So make sure they don't see us. That's an important part of this. I could actually go to the um, generator room because that's also a very, very tricky part of the mission, uh, and we do need to do that. So it's just like I don't know if I want to go there. I don't think I do. I don't think I do. It's it's very tricky. Uh, but what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna take this building out. If there's anybody in there, I don't think there is. We're just gonna be outside. Yeah, there's. I think it's clear. Far side is gonna sneak in. Jax can stay up. Oh, he's got detected. He got. Oh, he he get he got detected. I just yeah, I didn't get him out of, of sneaking. He just got it got himself out automatically. That's fine. They they see him, but they don't mind. So we have a door here. Okay, so yeah, this is a good approach building for that one over there because you can sneak in. And actually, let's look at uh, uh yeah, far side is good for that. But so is Steffi. She's pretty good. She's pretty amazing at sneaking, to be honest. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. Sneaking, and I'm gonna leave you for the later parts. And everybody else kind of can't sneak at all, so I mean, 18% he can sneak technically, but it's just it is just quite tricky. So I'm gonna le let you guys be here. I'm also gonna give uh, Steffi some bullets because she needs them for that pistol. And uh, Steffi, yeah, reload that. And I hope you're wearing the. Yeah, she, not wearing, but using the, the correct ones. There we go. Okay, so the strategy here is gonna be to try and take them out from here and then prevent them from activating that alarm in there. Because I think these are the only two alarms in this building. No, there's another one up there. Okay, so I think there's not nothing inside. But we should be in for a little bit of fun, if not for a successful attempt at doing this. So I'm gonna open the door. Another thing that I almost forgot. Dang it. Yeah, almost forgot that. Almost forgot that. Okay, so that guy's patrolling. I can go in and I can... Actually, I could bring everybody in. I think we can not hide from him. But he's kind of going away right now. It's really tricky. This is really tricky. You guys need to, yeah, do that. I'm not sure he's going to see us. The night is falling. That's a good thing. But if he looks this way, and he probably will. Okay, so he's going that way. My strategy is to, gonna, it's to be... Uh, Jack's upstairs. Okay, this is good. Okay. A good way to stop your characters to enter combat and exit very quickly. So, this is good. I'm gonna send Jax upstairs first. But I'm gonna have to be careful here. I'm gonna have to send him through here. That's kinda nasty. And I can break that alarm. No, oh, no, he's been detected. Oh, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna lose this. Broke alarm. Get up there. Get up there. Sneak if you can. Okay, good. Ooh! Okay. Up here, it's not safe. I'll just say that for right now. That guy will see us, so we need to be very careful. The only reason why I'm here is because that guy... There's no guys in here patrolling this particular level here. That was very... Who the hell saw us? They didn't do anything. Okay, so I want to be here. Oh, there's a guy right there. Okay. Okay. So strategy is going to be to be ready to shoot with this gun over here, but I am going to... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, good. Oh, man. Okay, he's patrolling that way, so I think I can go in for a kill without being detected by the guy upstairs, and if he... F please don't... Okay, there we go. Okay, we're good. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, we're good. So, strategy... Ow! Enter. Oh, man. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> that scared me. Um, I don't think we are in combat, uh, but just in case we are... I'm gonna bring these girls up here. 
He's not, he's sneaking. Okay, we're not in combat. Okay, go back, go back, go back, go back. Okay. That actually, oh, this is not bad. This is not bad. The reason why this is not bad, I'm not gonna save. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm gonna do this like this. Shoot him. Shoot him again. Nope. Okay, Farsight got shot. They both can sneak, so they were not detected. They can't, yeah, okay, so that was good. That was good. Farsight has got, I think, Mark to. Nope. Nope. Oh, they changed the soundtrack, but he didn't go for that terrible thing of terribleness. Um, so Farsight has got this armor right here. That's what I was hoping for. Steffi doesn't. Steffi still has a Mark 1 right there. Let our armor Mark 1. Uh, let me just uh, change the soundtrack there because I think I broke it. Uh, so I'm just reloading my save. There we go. And uh, yeah, my strategy here is to try and take that guy out if I can from afar. Uh, I'll, I did save the. I forgot I, I wasn't gonna save, but I did. Um, so that thing is broken. I think that thing can be broken as well. I might as well go for it. That guy. How? What's the chance to hit? It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I'm gonna go for it. Except for Steffi, though. Yeah, Ste no, I'm not gonna go for it. We need to be a little bit closer. And if they detect us, they detect us. So you go over there. Yeah, we're gonna be a little bit closer. Actually, we could take out the alarm system ourselves without him detecting us but we need to be a little bit more careful and a little bit faster so I'm gonna get Steffi to shoot him if he's if she sees him be uh, any good and with oh that's actually not good oh well, that's good okay so Steffi what can you do can go in the burst and let's do that oh I misclicked there okay he missed what the hell does he have apex ranger okay did we see that gun before I don't know Farsight, fortunately, has got line of sight, and we leveled up. Somebody leveled up right there. You guys can go back into sneaking, and we are good. We're good to go. That was that was fantastic. Very satisfied with how that went, even though it was kind of messy. Uh, because, uh, yeah, because of that thing right there. Uh, but that's good to know that they don't hear me. I'm going to try and loot that guy over there, and actually Farsight can go ahead and loot that one over there. Uh, this guy... Ooh, what the hell is that? I know this weapon. It's a very old. It's it's. Is it a, an automatic sniper? Yeah, I think it is. Let's see what Farsad can get out of that one. There's guys up here as well, so we need to be careful about that as well. So yeah, let's bring you guys back here. She was not detected, but she did break. Oh, she leveled up. That's nice. I'm gonna take. Oh, nice. So let's see. Educated doesn't. Yeah, educated. It's not really something that I go for. A flower child, likely addicted. Uh, to, yeah, that's fine. Uh, heavy ho, hit the deck. That's interesting. I never used it. Oh, more criticals. That's the one I want for sure. Silent running would be pretty good for her. Uh, and actually, I'm going to pick it for her. Far side, maybe. Uh, I'm going to try and be sneaky as well. But since I'm... Yeah, we'll see how that goes. But silent running is really nice. Actually, I remember. She is usually... I usually go with silent running for her. Her luck is, is very good. Uh, that's going to bring her critical chance up by a lot. Um, and she kind of needs it because she doesn't have the aims. Uh... Right now, I think more criticals is going to be better because we're not going to really be using silent running all that much. Just because she's still not at that point and we are at that point where you can just, you know, run all... No, be up, upright while sneaking. So you need to be careful about that right there. Okay, so you two guys get like that one. Who are you seeing? I don't know. Next up, we got Jax up here. And don't think I have forgotten about you, Jax. I still know you're over there. So the reason why Jax hasn't done anything this whole time is because there's only one guy here patrolling. That guy, on the other hand, has got a hold 45, so I should be able to take him out. Oh no, that one has got a hunting rifle. Oh, uh, that's not as good. Oh, where the hell is he? He's... Oh yeah, it's the dog, dog thing. Okay, so it would be a good idea, I think, to bring everybody up here. I hope. Oh, you see, by the way, that's uh, the daughter. That's the daughter right there. Let's see what Jax can do here. Oh, he's ready to shoot. He's gonna shoot. Oh, that's what you get! He's gonna overwatch, probably. Maybe not. Oh, that's what you get. Okay, so you girls, you guys, you guys are up here. You're gonna stay up there. I think there's connection. I think there's a connection for, from in here. That should be, anyway. I think so. Never approach from up here. I usually enter through that one, because you can, after that, after what I'm doing right now, you can clear out this passage without much problem. That guy's gonna shoot Jax maybe a couple times. A single time and he misses and he crouches because he's an idiot and he did shoot again. Uh, either, uh, yeah, he probably didn't have enough action points. Otherwise, he probably would have shot again. Although, he should have done the opposite of what he just did. He should have crouched and then shot. But foresight is not a thing that AI is known for. So, there we go. Those guys are dead. I can sneak. Nobody minds me. 
I'm gonna loot that guy's body. Let's also see if I have the room for whatever he has. Hopefully I do, but mm, I wouldn't count on that. Uh, let's continue moving in. Hmm. Okay, so the, the idea here is gonna be to approach from inside. The thing is, I think there's a huge... No, that's not. Okay, so this is... We need to be careful, because there, there's that clause in here. There's that clause, so we need to be very careful. Actually, at this point, I think I could bring my old team through there without much problem. Just up here, we should be fine. I'm gonna bring Farsight over there. She's gonna be ready to shoot if she wants to. You are gonna be able to be... Nah, you shouldn't. You should Actually, Farsight shouldn't either, since she's sneaking. So, yeah, let's see what this guy has. Uh, I think that's gonna go over my allotted um, inventory space. Yes, indeed. That's fine. Steffi is gonna check out this veranda. Because uh, I think that's an English word. It's not really a veranda. It's like a landing sort of thing. It's not a landing because a landing needs, uh, in English anyway, a landing needs to uh, to have like stairs, I think. And maybe it doesn't. It kind of, to me, it looks like a, To me, I would call it a landing, but it's... I don't know if it is. Anyway, Steffi is going to go back there. And I think we are going to be fine there. Jax is going to just unload his load on either Steffi or Farsight. Giddy. Uh, that's because he's encumbered, so he needs to take care of that as well. I don't think I should be sneaking here, but again, it's one of those things. I'm being careful. And too careful. You can never be too careful. Unless... I have said this way too many times before. Unless, of course, you can't be careful and you need to be reckless. Sometimes it's important. I think at this point, recklessness is warranted because uh, we had, we have saved. There's a guy over there. I need to kill that guy. Who the, where the hell was he? He's going to be fine because he doesn't have alarm systems to activate. So we can kill him at the last. What I really want to focus on is on the daughter that should be down here. I didn't see her, but she should be down there. As long as I have the objective, he'll fade the, he'll fade the mission. Fail the mission if you if she dies. I think. Well, anyway, according to what the mayor said, uh, or somebody said, uh, the de the the beast lords are gonna activate, as it were, the death clause as soon as they hear a disturbance. So I'd rather that didn't happen. Uh, just you know, just my preference. So at this point, I think I can bring Jax down there. Oh, actually, he needs to uh, unload his burdens. Uh, let's do that. Staffy is yeah, she's fine. She can take she can take more. Let's give her some of that. Let's give him some of this pipe right there. We got a talon mark. Oh, that's the one. This is the, used to be the Desert Eagle. It used to be. Oh, there's a lot. That's a lot of bone that Jax has. But Steffi doesn't mind. She she can take a couple. Uh, so, yeah, let's... Uh, did I say bone? I should have said bones. Uh, let's go down there. Can you please go down there? Thank you. Okay, let's be careful as well. Because there will be a guy over there. But I will be able to kill him with relative ease if I'm careful. If I'm not, I won't be able to kill him with any ease, any ease at all. But I think if Jax can be down there, so can Farsight and... Oh, not Stitch. Not Stitch. No, Stitch is back there. So can Farsight... No, Farsight goes there. Mm -hmm. And Staffy. Yeah. She is... She is kind of... She kind of has a weird name because... I don't know. It's just my dirty mind thinking, to be honest. And if you know what I'm talking about, then you know what I'm talking about. Otherwise, never mind. I'm just... Yeah, it's just my dirty mind working. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, Oh crap, you guys saw that? You guys saw that? Yeah, there's death loss in here. There's death loss. And there's an alarm system right there. That's gonna be interesting. I think I can take this guy out, but I'd rather try not to. So let's see if Steffi can have game for right now. We're gonna try... Oh, I just looked at the time. We're gonna... <laughs> Man, I'm having too much fun. Too much fun with this game. Oh, no, this is bad. That death claw is gonna see my butt. Uh, but it could be good. No, 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 go go there. Don't waste time. Okay, that death claw is not gonna... They are hairy, by the way, which is something that makes no sense whatsoever, because death claws are mutated, uh, chame chameleons? Yeah, chameleons is the name. It's the word. Sorry, pronounce that. So I'm gonna disable that. Oh, that death claw. Oh, he's going in there. He's gonna, he's gonna check his, his email or something. That, that, that guy. Break it, break it, break it. Yeah, break it like a minute. Okay, so let's go back. Oh, no, don't come here. Okay, and I think with that, I'm going to break the episode here. And hopefully we'll survive what is going to happen on the next one. For now, though, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Fallout Tactics Redux. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.